What's up YouTube, Stefano Turtle here, and today I am coming at you guys with a video on Dueling Book of me testing a custom deck. And, uh, well, I was playing Thunder Dragon Dino earlier, but um, I built this deck and played it. I made a few of the cards to this. This is a community made archetype, which is the Dragonic deck. Specifically, more Dragonic Knight slash Overlord. And, um, this deck's got some plays. It's not the best, but definitely got some cool plays. So, I'm going to show one replay real quick. And then I will get to the custom. We'll actually get to the plays. And yes, not all my plays I have won. So this is by... Game has been gotten on. And we'll put this to fast forward. Actually, no, I'll put it to play so I can explain everything. So this is their incarnation deck, and they're just trying to establish a board here essentially. Looks like stuff from World of Warcraft to be honest. So they're obviously doing their searches. This is a custom deck, if you want to try it by the way. And so is this one. Nope, I'm clicking next play so it goes along faster. So they search a card Mage Guild, and I'll list them. I'm gonna search a card as well. right now. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just gonna let this play. So they get a search Incarnation of Immortality Phoenix. That gets a counter. They accidentally put a card to their deck, so they get it back, which is called Mysterious Obelisk. And they use it to search. Getting Phoenix. Then they summon water. Summon fire. Then link someone for four. To legendary Azure Dragon. Then this card. Custom fusion summon by recycling. This deck interests me, but I don't know how to play it. <laughs> so, they get this dragon out. And they pass. I summon my aspiring Dragonic Knight so I can search a card. And I add Hono. This is one of the Dragonic Knights I made. And. Activate it in Pendulum Zone. Use the effect, which is essentially is a um, Cleefort Towers, except it searches uh, Dragonic cards. And I made it mine to put except Dragonic Diagram. No one else did. And it's just simply because I hate that. So I went to search the pen other Pendulum I played, Boldar the Quake. And then just Pendulum Summon. And then I pop their mage guild. Sorry for my family in the background. I link summon and they get mage guild to add fire. So then they summon, no, I summon Dragonic Neo Flame, which lets me search. Of course. So I think I add Dragonic Calling, I'm not entirely sure. You know, I add the field spell Dragonic Battleground, then use that, then I read what the dragon did, and I was like, okay. I'm recording a video! I'm recording a video for YouTube! Well, now you finished. Take Rufus out? No. 
Okay. So this is establishing a board. Then summons gets rid of their dragon. One of them <laughs> goes into another one to. Well, they set all my cards face down, so I'm just thinking, what can I do here? Then they board. They completely board wipe me, and I'm just like, oh. Well, but thank goodness the pendulum's a, the other one's a quick effect, and this one search summon. Then I go into a synchro, use Honos, get clan, summon, XZ summon, return to draw, and attack for game. The deck has its plays, but if you don't get them off, then yeah, we're not going into the second round. We are going for one game here, and sorry, that was my um, aunt telling me that I needed to do some things, text my stepdad essentially, and also um, take the dog out when I'm done, so <laughs> I'm just going to leave that in, and we'll do this. Simple enough, custom archetypes only, nothing stupidly OP. Because <laughs> there are some custom cards that are stupidly OP. Gee, thanks, DZ. You freaking stop playing stupid cards. I am not even joking. He made a link monster that says that. And when they summon a card, when there's a card on your opponent's field that says it's unaffected by anything, like, you win the duel. Simple as that. It's just stupid. And it's like, well, it's obviously about to be 10. I'm doing this at nighttime, and my cats are in the room. So, okay, we'll face the little old man. Just because I'm curious. Ask him what archetype it is, but first, as is a common courtesy, at say good luck and have fun. Stop spelling that. I'm gonna wait for them. That's all like a. Okay, that sounds cool. Start by activating Draconic Diet. Right, Battlefield. Oof. Not that much I can do here. Activate Baldar. And then activate battleground. Pop the boulder. Got Aspiring Dragon Knight. Aspiring Effect, which will let me get a search. So, what I want to do here is add Hono to get us another search, and then spam the field, Link Summon, then probably XZ Summon. So, they were put in the K. So it's thumbs up from them. Take a thousand to search. 
essentially towers. <laughs> uh, what do I want to add now? Add Dragonic Calling. Pendulum Summon. Calling, that's me summon two. Nope, this is also my own card. I'll wait to see what they say. And let's link summon. For Neo Flame. For Dragonic Revenge. And summon Draco Generation Dragonic Knight. Then go into our link three Dragonic Overlord the Legend. It's essentially a um, Skulltrade. <laughs> So what I do is reveal five and choose two Dragonic monsters and the rest go to the bottom. And then I'll pass. Also I like how we both have our images as door guide. Dark Matter Torch. Okay. Dark Generation um, Dragonic Knight has is it, its um, own effect, and Overlord has a protection as well as Knight. And I can. I can quickly pop Boldar to boost one of their attacks by 1200 if I want. And due to Battleground, they all gain 500, so this is at 3000, this is at 35. Well, let's see. Once per turn, you can make all Dark Matter Link monsters you control gain 100 attack times the combined Link rating of all. Well, that's cool. Bit of a lackluster picture, but it's definitely a cool design for a card. Nope, this card and Draconic Overlords that it points to can't be destroyed by card effects. Or just by effects or cards, so... Yeah, and if he targets, Generation Knight will stop the target, so... Oh, I'm just waiting on them. Because I have... Let's see... 6,500 points of damage on the board. And they just scooped. <laughs> Damn. People can't really figure out how to play against this deck, because... Well, the cards do a lot. So, I guess I'll just end this recording off here. This is the Stefano Turtle signing out. Hope you enjoyed, and good.